unhealthy while unhinged. <laughs> that word, man, unhinged. I feel like it was a popular word in the last like three or four months. You know what I mean? There's a bunch of unhinged songs that kind of went off. So I'll see what these guys got. Very small, 61 subscribers. This song has 1,300 plays in a couple of days, which is decent. This is one of their first songs and videos. They haven't even been a band for two months. And now they're on tour and dropping merch and music. So these guys are on to something. And if they're this far down my list here, it's probably going to be a banger. They do have anime-themed merch with a hint of horror and limited run exclusive designs. So they just uh, pretty much release those, and they're going fast. So I'll hit it down in the link below, guys. Go check it out. If you like what you see and hear today, See what these guys got on this one. This one's called Trump Card. <laughs> this is a Trump Card. That's your personal favorite? Okay, let's go, Channing. Kinda gives me some uh, dead crown vibes. With some cyber sense. Was that uh, a Letter Kenny quote, though? I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, he kind of does have a little I Prevail, like Eric from I Prevail screams. Yeah, I can, I can kind of see that. Hold on, I want that break. Give your balls a tug, you titfuck. Yeah, I think that was Letter Kenny. Give your balls a, a tug, you t What? I don't know what it was, but. It was Shorzy from Letter County. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought it totally was. I'm like, fuck. I'm like, I know that voice. And I feel like I knew that line too. Even though I haven't, I've only watched like the first season on that one, but I really love it. I need to go back on it. Um, so that was fun. Um, yeah, nice like Dead Crown vibes on here, which is really nice. I feel like I need another Dead Crowns band on um in my playlist because of like now they're not playing anymore. Uh, give your balls a tug, you tit fucker. Is that what he says? 
<laughs> this one definitely gave our balls a tug. That's for sure. <laughs> no bluff though. I was a kind of ex I wanted to bluff off that one, but it was really cool. Really cool. It, it's got some cool vibes. It's got like that tough guy kind of vibe in there. Um, I guess it's more a political kind of thing involved with it. I won't get into it. Um, but other than that, I thought it was really good. Nice and bouncy, nice production. Uh, the only thing I would kind of change up is just that and the little synthy part I thought was a little repetitive in a way and a little overpowering, just like to the point where like I got to the end of the song, wanted to hear something a little bit different on there, but it had kind of the same flow throughout the whole entire thing. Wanted it switched up a little bit, but they did kind of break it up with the breakdown a little bit slower on there. So other than that, like that was a really good fun song. Definitely something to bang your head to for sure. That's dope.